Stoat. The stoat or short-tailed weasel, Mustela ermenia, also known as the ermine, is a mustelid native to Eurasia and North America. Because of its wide circumpolar distribution, it is listed as least concern on the IUCN red list. The name ermine is used for species in the genus Mustela, especially the stoat, in its pure white winter coat, or the fur thereof. In the late 19th century, it was introduced into New Zealand to control rabbits, where they have had a devastating effect on native bird populations. It was nominated as one of the world's top 100 worst invaders. Ermine luxury fur was used in the 15th century by Catholic monarchs, who sometimes used it as the Mozetta cape. It was also used in capes on images such as the infant Jesus of Prague. As with the least weasel, mouse-like rodents predominate in the stoat's diet. However, unlike the least weasel, which almost exclusively feeds on small voles, the stoat regularly preys on larger rodent and lagomorph species, and will take down individuals far larger than itself. In Russia, its prey includes rodents and lagomorphs such as European water voles, common hamsters, pikers, and others, which it overpowers in their burrows. Prey species of secondary importance include small birds, fish, and shrews and, more rarely, amphibians, lizards, and insects. Physical description. The stoat is entirely similar to the least weasel in general proportions, manner of posture, and movement, though the tail is relatively longer, always exceeding a third of the body length, though it is shorter than that of the long-tailed weasel. The stoat has an elongated neck, the head being set exceptionally far in front of the shoulders. The trunk is nearly cylindrical, and does not bulge at the abdomen. The greatest circumference of body is little more than half its length. The skull, although very similar to that of the least weasel, is relatively longer, with a narrower brain case. The projections of the skull and teeth are weakly developed, but stronger than those of the least weasel. The eyes are round, black and protrude slightly. The whiskers are brown or white in color, and very long. The ears are short, rounded and lie almost flattened against the skull. The claws are not retractable, and are large in proportion to the digits. Each foot has five toes. The male stoat has a curved baculum with a proximal knob that increases in weight as it ages. Fat is deposited primarily along the spine and kidneys, then on gut mesenteries, under the limbs and around the shoulders. The stoat has four pairs of nipples, though they are visible only in females. The dimensions of the stoat are variable, but not as significantly as the least weasels. Unusual among the carnivora, the size of stoats tends to decrease proportionally with latitude, in contradiction to Bergman's rule. Sexual dimorphism in size is pronounced, with males being roughly 25% larger than females and 1.5 to 2.0 times their weight. On average, males measure 187 to 325 mm in body length, while females measure 170 to 270 mm. The tail measures 75 to 120 mm in males and 65 to 106 mm in females. In males, the hind foot measures 40.0 to 48.2 mm, while in females it is 37.0 to 47.6 mm. The height of the ear measures 18.0 to 23.2 mm in males and 14.0 to 23.3 mm. The skulls of males measure 39.3 to 52.2 mm in length, while those of females measure 35.7 to 45.8 mm. Males average 258 grams in weight, while females weigh less than 180 grams. Fur. The winter fur is very dense and silky, but quite closely lying and short, while the summer fur is rougher, shorter and sparse. In summer, the fur is sandy brown on the back and head and a white below. The division between the dark back and the light belly is usually straight, though this trait is only present in 13.5% of Irish stoats. The stoat molts twice a year. In spring, the molt is slow, starting from the forehead, across the back, toward the belly. In autumn, the molt is quicker, progressing in the reverse direction. The molt, initiated by photoperiod, starts earlier in autumn and later in spring at higher latitudes. In the stoat's northern range, it adopts a completely white coat, save for the black tail tip, during the winter period. Differences in the winter and summer coats are less apparent in southern forms of the species. In the species' southern range, the coat remains brown, but is denser and sometimes paler than in summer. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy the video, please like and subscribe.